Hey guys, Alex is Gane, and today I have for us a bet analysis on PPP Heads or Tails. Looks like a pretty cool PVP event from what I've seen so far. Good old comic, start off with that. Nothing so useful as a soft plate, easy as lamb to stuff with hate. Your old head I took for a bit of bread, made you my willing whip, star of a comic strip. Welcome to my arena, hope you're a screamer. Turn tail and run away, that's always fun. How about I kick you in the head instead? How about I take yours and call it first course? I love the rhyming, uh, little rhyming comic things. It's the star which they've kept with. Okay, so this is the first change. What I've seen so far, this looks really cool. Um, it's, they've kind of just improved it from how it was, and I'll go. Uh, I'll show you why. Click on the more section. So we've got um, these gold ones now, and then the red ones. So the red ones are pretty much unchanged, except for the same amount of points. The percentages have gone up, and also as the percentages have gone up, if you um, on the the inverse percentage, um, we'll call it. So there's eighty percent chance of getting the legendary now if you score above 4 million points so in the, in the off chance that you don't get the legendary you're pretty much guaranteed to get the epic so there's a 20% chance of getting the epic of this is the leaderboard prize so it's still the leaderboard prize um, the way it works kind of just um, they've put in a chance to get the epic as well in case you it's better than it was just like um, the percentages were just for getting the legendary, and then it was just you could get any of this. Could be crap, complete crap, like that's pretty crap, these are pretty crap. And then some better rares of these ones, and then there's like a whole bunch of crappy epics, like this, this. There's also good epics as well. Um, but how it works so, this is the, the main prize, the legendary, and its epic form is there. So if you score about 4 million points, there's an 80% chance that you'll get to convert your uh, Sibleth into um, the Legendary, and if you don't, then you get the Epic form, which is still pretty good. Um, same thing, similar thing for 2.5 million points, 40% chance that you can convert it to the Legendary, and if you're unsuccessful, 60% chance guaranteed to get the Epic at least. Um, and then moving down, so if you score above a million points, um, you've got still got a 10% chance at the legendary and 50% chance at the epic um, So that means that there's a 40% chance that you could get like junk or some of these other ones in here So if we scroll back up Hopefully it's done lagging with me and then even for 50,000 points. This is really cool So this means it's pretty much a, a point total that pretty much everyone should be able to achieve so even with uh, 50,000 points you have a 20% chance at getting an epic of the leaderboard prize, which is very nice. Um, at 200,000 points, which is still pretty achievable, 30% um, chance of building the epic, so that's really cool. Um, it's gonna put more leaderboard prizes into into the system, um, which is something great to see. Makes it more achievable for other people. So this is the actual leaderboard prize. Arapikianka, something like that, whatever. Suckle all Elite 4+, plus because the 404 Legend, as you can see there. Um, interesting sprite, get into that in a sec. So Suckle all uh, Rank 3 Magical Skill, leaves you st satted, and your foes weak as mewing babies. Mewling. Whatever that means. Um, it's probably just going to be an attack ball based off Wisdom. So its stats are pretty nice, got good HP. Good wisdom, one of the best ones. Um, really comes down to multipliers for these legendaries. If it's got half decent, it's easily a replacement for Lady of the Lake. And this is its uh, ability. I personally think it looks really cool. It's just like sucking their souls. Kind of reminds me of uh, Adventure Time, actually. The, it's, um, yeah, the, the, the guy from the Underworld. Um, bracket battle prizes. So these ones, um, unfortunately, not that useful because of the smash two cooldown. But we have good attack fodder. It's almost got 7k attack. 
So it's going to give above 800 as infusion, which is really good. Um, shame it can't be used um, for much else besides that. But attack fodder. This one, um, this isn't even fodder. It's agility fodder, which we've already got stacks of. It's, it's not bad agility fodder. Gives 720, roughly. Um, yeah, that's about it. It's a Sting 1 cooldown, so again, not really going to be used. Oh, let's have leader skills. Leader skill, nothing special. Nothing special after the, the uh, leaderboard prize. We've got um, something that boosts Wisdom of All the Wind by 1500. So that's okay. Just okay. Call it. And then finally, we have this. This thing. Um, pretty nice. Pay build, so it's kind of a premium sort of fighter. 10k HP, 14k attack. Wisdom is pretty high as well, it's in the 9k, so it's clearly a warlock. Agility is pretty high up there as well, it's 4.2k. Defense is pretty low because it, it is a warlock. Um, so it's got a double skill, rank 3 double skill, puts up a shield and rains down a harvest of pain for all. So um, we can expect kind of a, a defense buff. Not sure if it's going to be a defense buff for just, just him or the line. Um, and then the second part of the double skill is pretty clear. It's going to be an attack all. Um, and the... Go away. <laughs> the... Whatchamacallit. The lady skill is actually really cool. It's the first time we've seen something to, like this, to my knowledge. Um, this one actually boosts... HP by 1500 for fire types. So, to my knowledge, it's the first that I've seen something boost HP. The rest have just been attack, wisdom, agility, I think defense. Um, there could be others out there, but this is the first significant one that boosts it by that much. So, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. There's a lot of firefighters out there, so um, HP is definitely something that can be worth boosting, especially for. Pretty much everything, dungeon, siege, sentries, and PvP, it all helps. So yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool looking move as well. Just like, flows it from his slingshot whip thing. Looks very similar to his head as well. So yeah, th those are the fighters and stuff. Um, what we have as Invite ID. Which is interesting, it's not, um, it hasn't really stuck to the, the usual system. They've brought back quite an old fighter. Um, this Red Witch would have been a long time ago um, that we had her. She's definitely an old fighter. She's still a good one. Look at those stats, unedged, almost 6k wisdom, 5.5k agility. So definitely a decent fighter. It makes her more obtainable now. Um, that's pretty much it. First day for me, I didn't play too much, got promoted, just enough to get promoted. Um, I'm not going to play this PvP event, don't really play PvP, haven't got enough Nux bits. Um, but I'll probably just farm it, try to get some more Nux bits and stuff. Uh, a couple things I did see. You know what? I'm going to do the first step of the pay build. Um, even though I'm not competing, well, it doesn't matter for these uh, PvP because they're not on edge or anything, but. Um, yeah, I don't know, I'll try, um, I'm not going to do any other paid builds, so just the first step, might as well put it in this video. Never know, could get the legendary. Okay, for some reason it's like, frozen. Stop it, stop it. Ooh, ooh, that kind of stuff things. Ooh, ooh, undo, undo. Okay, now, now it's like the middle. Let me just... Oh, oh, so you, you do want me to purchase. Do you? Let's click purchase. Where is it? Uh, it's something like that. That's in the middle, right? I can't tell. Come on. Just build. Build it. Such suspense. All for one. Come on. Take my money. Take it. Take it. For some reason it's like frozen. Okay, I'm back. Take two. Hopefully it uh, doesn't freeze me this time. Here we go. Rare. Ah, uh, fix up the paid builds. I don't. Stop giving us rubbish. It's BS. B 
BS. Okay, that's it for this one, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Um, if you did, leave it a like. And, yeah, leave it a like if you want me to keep doing them. Um, not getting as many views. I'm not sure if you guys even watch them anymore. But, yeah, let me know if you, you still want them. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye.